Hello, my lovely Virgo. How you guys are doing? Today we'll do the reading for next week. This will be a weekly from the 8th of March till the 15th. Okay. Keep in mind, this is a general love reading and this will be for the sign of Virgo. Okay. It's a love reading and whatever situation will be, will develop whatever Angels tells me, I will tell you guys. Okay. So let's see for Virgo for the second week of March. All right. Let's see here, Virgo. And what's the energies for this week? We have Four of Swords. Eight of Pentacles, Two of Cups, and Seven of Wands. All right, we have all the signs here. You could deal with anybody, whatever resonates with you, but on the bottom it's Ten of Cups, okay? I'm feeling here you are in a healing process. You're focusing on yourself, okay? For many of you, you're focusing on your work, for many of you, you focus to work on yourself because I see here the healing card with the Eight of Pentacles that's telling me you work on yourself. Even if you are thinking of a person here, a deeply soulmate, somebody who loves you, who love them, yeah. But what I'm feeling here, you are. You don't, I don't see moves from your side. What I'm seeing here, it's just in your head mostly. You don't know how to start probably a conversation. You don't even know if the person still loves you or the person still thinking of you because you're still in like in a standby move, mood, okay? But I'm feeling here for many, many of you Virgos, you're just focusing on your work because you feel the work is giving you peace. I'm feeling for some of you, you are praying for something to happen, like in a home environment, as we have ten of cups underneath. Okay, I will tell. I'll take ten of cups and I'll put it here for you guys. But let's see what's going on for this week for my Virgos. Okay, as we're reading mostly general, seven of pentacles, three of pentacles, judgment. It's definitely a home situation here for you. Could be a money situation here, but I'm feeling here very soon you will have communication with the person you are dealing. Be aware this person is not at the same page as you are. Virgo, okay? Very confused. Wow, the devil at the end, okay? But it is deep love here. Also, I'm here and here. If you wait for some time for communication for, from this person and reunite with this person, I'm feeling they are still holding back because they might feel you could be a toxic person or you might hold back because you think they are a toxic person but i'm feeling here a reunion i'm feeling here a movement here also what i'm feeling here communication it is coming after a long freaking wait wow it's still emotion, but it's mixed emotion in this case. A lot, a lot of mixed emotions between you and this person. You might think that this person moved on. They might moved on from you, Virgo, but they didn't move emotionally. They still in that emotional feel, yeah? But I see you, you will see this person. You will communicate with this person. This person you are dealing could be a fire sign or could be a fellow earth sign, okay? But I'm feeling here they they have mixed emotions for you, okay? But you, for some reason, you feel tight, tied to them, and you don't really know what they do. 
also what I'm feeling this person if the communication you're not really when I'm saying you are not at the same page with this person is just the communication is a bit off I feel this person is not really opening up could be you Virgo but I'm gathering information about them they're not really opening up and that makes you more anxious more confused they might even tell you I moved on but you don't really see them moving on and that's the confusion you really really want to work it out but I'm feeling here a lot still a lot of stagnation between you and this person okay what I'm gathering here after this communication even if you'll still like what's going on with this person they moving on they stay they moving on they stay but I'm feeling here some guidance will come towards you okay the universe is stepping in with the judgment here and tells you you know what to do I feel here for some of you it's coming a reconciliation here and I feel you will be very happy if this person because I feel here somebody will open up one of you is not really open up one of you is open up and wants this situation clarified but with the judgment here I see deeply a reconciliation with this person after the truth is spoken okay I feel here this person might not open up right away as you wish Virgo but eventually they will open up okay eventually they will tell you what it is going on okay but let's see here some clarification for my Virgos Queen of Swords usually I Yeah. Clear communication could be a Sag here, Virgo. A Sag. Wow, 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 wow. Deeply soulmate relationship, but with the temperance and judgment and three of cups here, I see a, a reunion between you and them. But I'm feeling here you are in a healing process regarding this reconciliation also what I'm feeling here for many of you if you didn't open up in the past now is the time this person is a gift to you they want to work it out or could be vice versa as I always said but if you're waiting for communication it is coming communication here yep and I'm feeling here you Virgo you need to take you need to take action here with the magician and three of cups if you want to see this person you need to take action because this person who you dealing strongly earthly or sad energy they they want to speak they they make plans they are very sure on themselves yeah but still still a lot like should I go should I stay like what I'm feeling here Virgo this person been through a lot if you heard them in the past they might be very guarded why they very guarded they don't want to get hurt again okay but they want to talk they want to talk because also they cannot move on they might even tell you I want to move on or I moved on from you but yep yeah, some of you after this communication you might have a reconciliation with this person and move forward for some of you for some of you will be an ending depends whatever the talk will be be aware this person Aries Leo or Sag which I'm gathering for you guys it's a very spoken person very sure on themselves they always taking like initiative they always do what they think is great for them okay Virgo be aware of that because I'm feeling here for some of you will be a reconciliation for some of you you're just an end 
for some of you the communication will be about all the the confusion what happened in the past so you will be done with that and then you will start depends how this communication will take place but I'm feeling here Virgo this is you what I'm feeling here that's a lot of people involved in here if you listen to other people I feel don't because they are not telling you exactly how it is and I always say listen to your heart okay listen to your mind why because they are your best guidance you could have ever for the person is in the place also don't listen to other people because other people never been in a relationship with this person you've been in a relationship with this person and I'm feeling here it's a strongly fire sign here a very cold and I'm feeling also you are cold towards them okay you really want to speak it out they really want to speak it out and I feel here will be a meeting between you and this person and speak it out don't focus on the past on negativities okay because I strongly feel this person loves you but the choice will be on you seven of wands again okay if you wanna move forward with this person and make it work because I see could could be a potential to work it out Virgo and other things yeah I see communication but it's only up to you Virgo if you wanna work it out or not also who I'm speaking here this Virgo I, I see deep inside you want a reconciliation but you are very like afraid to not get hurt again that's what I'm hearing and you also kind of feel like you are not really worthy of this person why we are all worthy of love okay and I'm feeling you have air in the chart you could deal with an air sign but I see it's a fire here who wants to speak Virgo but let's see here what let's see messages from the person you are connected could be a fire sign could be an air sign could be any sign Virgo okay whatever you are connected take it as it is let's see here what was the messages from this person towards you three of wands they they have big expectation from you also they might be out of distance they they are not next to you also they feel left out in the cold also their finances could be a little shaky or they feel they they lost they are lost kind of feeling they will not make any moves even they they want to they will not make any moves but they want to make things fairly they want they want to know what's on the other side they want to know clarity from you they need clarity Virgo but they love you they make a choice they are making a choice now should I stay should I move should I stay should I move okay but they need clarity they need clarity also what I'm feeling this person they want to speak it out they want to take it out from their chest they love you I see a lot of love here but also they feel very betrayed for some reason yeah let's see what action you Virgo needs to do towards this person you are connecting judgment you really really want to reconcile if you are thinking of this person strongly and you feel this is your soulmate because I see soulmate relationship don't wait too much because I'm feeling here you take your sweet time this person is a very beautiful good person to you and the universe blessed you with this person yeah they are very this person is a very nurturing person a very good-hearted person they love you they want a new beginning if you think to go towards them they still have a lot of love towards you they want to talk to you they still have passion towards you Virgo okay 
this you should do. Let's take this too. And here's again King of Wands here. Strongly fire sign here. Give me two cards here. Strength. Very strong person. Leo energy. But I'm feeling here the cards is telling you get the strength in you and go towards this person. Because this person will not make moves even if you think. Don't think of the past. If you want things balanced in your life, do not focus on the past. Do not focus on the past hurt. Because the Two of Cups is just right behind you. Here it is. If you want to be happy, do not focus on your past. Move forward. Alright, my lovely Virgo. This is your reading for this week. And I'll see you next time. Bye for now.